So, Coach, just what kind of went into that second half run for Oregon? What kind of went into that? You know, it's like uh, you know, almost watching two different teams, really, for that second half. Just um, didn't come out right out of the shoot with, with our same intensity on defense. Weren't able to generate any stops. Um, you know, they shot at one point in the second half, and I think the under four or under eight, I can't remember. It was, I think they were shooting 76% in the field in the half. So, you know, we're not going to beat a team like this if, uh, if that's how we perform at that under the floor. And, uh, you know, we had other, you know, uh, we shot 43% uh, from the field. It wasn't bad. I, I might have signed on for that based on how we shoot. But we, the quality of our shots were pretty good. We missed a lot of open shots in this game, and again, against a good team. Uh, you can't uh, afford to miss open shots. It didn't seem like you generated the turnovers we've talked about, your defense generating your offense, and it yeah. just seemed like you didn't get, they actually had more points off turnovers than you guys. Yeah, they did, uh, They whatever they talked about at halftime, you know, they were uh, different in that regard. We uh, were able to to be more active in the first half and get some deflections, get stops, and we got out, were able to run. and. Uh, you know, I, but even the first half, I, I thought we missed too many open shots again. If we had an open look on the road against a team like this and you can't make it, you, you know, you're hurting yourself. You know, we were up five. Maybe I think we should have been up doubles, but we didn't We didn't convert some, some shots that we need to make on, against a good team on the road. You did have one point in the lineup where you had Celebonge, Gaffney, and Sean in there all at the same time. I don't remember you doing that before. Is that something you might try a little more often? It was uh, it, it, it was just how the rotation flowed. I think that was in the first half. We didn't stay with it very long, but uh, you know they they had two seven footers, so they didn't have that presence. And uh, you know priority for us was was the paint. And uh, you know with Dante, you know, we actually won the paint. I think somehow in this game, uh, despite the final score. So there were some good things done in this game, but just you know we got to put together 40 minutes. I mean, against a team like this, we can't have stretches the way we played the second half. Um, with the lack of bench depth at the moment, um, is that kind of playing into the offense and in the second half trail? They're a loaded team with their with their depth. I mean, they have a bunch of guys that they could put in the game and, and not really miss a beat. So they, they uh, you know, their bench, uh, 33 to 18 on the bench uh, differential, so that's not going to you know, going to help us uh, win a lot of games if, if that's that uh, that statistic. Now we rely more on our starters to play heavier minutes. So, but uh, we we gotta we gotta do a better job of controlling guys that aren't their frontline players. You know, they have, they have multiple. I think they had two guys with doubles coming off the bench. You, so guys, you guys did a good job of we talked. You talked about the composure part of it. I thought you guys did a phenomenal job in that regard too, especially given you guys were kind of struggling in the second half. Guys really did not get too involved in that. Yeah, no, I mean, I, I think it was an anomaly, you know, what happened a couple of games back. You know, I think we're, uh, you know, that that's kind of behind us, hopefully. But, yeah, I mean, we, you know, it was just, it was a lot of adversity in that half. I mean, we didn't really, you know, we never made a stand to stop the bleeding in that game at all at either end of the floor. So it just felt like the type of situation that just kept getting worse. And we were not able, after they made their run at us, to go up seven or eight at, at one of the timeouts to to make our push again and to get back in the game and we just kind of let them continually get separation in the game. Jose Pope Pope has a really good first half. Um, what kind of went into the adjustments for them to take him out as a you know, as a go go? Okay. Oh, sorry. Uh, Jose Perez, really good first half. Um, what into their defensive adjustments to take him out as being as impactful in the second? Half? I, I think he finished with 20, right? I mean, he had 12 at halftime, so I mean, I don't know, he was, I'm not sure what they really did schematically to do anything different. I mean, Jose, he was 8 for 12 from the field and you know, had a really solid game for us. Um, so I, I, don't, I don't think they did anything really to, to change that matchup. Really high pace in the second half. How do you guys going forward, deeper in the pack, both play, keep up the endurance? I thought we were felt like we were the quicker team, the better conditioned team in the first half. I felt like they appeared at, at times to be more fatigued than we were. We, uh, I don't know if it's if it's their depth and uh, they, you know all the energy we exerted to, to get the lead took something out of us, but we have to be able to sustain a higher level of effort on the defensive end than what we showed here in the second half today. On the aspect, uh, on the last one. Yeah, last one. Uh, on the aspect of rebounding, um, 
just with some undersized guys and lacking depth at that position right now. How do you compensate for that to be able to compete with some of these guys like Dante and things yeah. like that? I mean, I, I think it was dead even on the backboard, close. Uh, uh, I don't know, they, they were plus eight, which, you know, is, is not bad for us. Um, and the bottom line is they got 32 defensive rebounds because we missed shots. And so they only had three offensive rebounds, so it was three to two in that in that statistical category. So the, the, the you know the rebounding tonight was not really an issue. Thanks, Matt. You got it.